Uh, okay, I got one the viewers. H Money, can you show your video again, brother? What's up, bro? How you doing, brother? What's good? What oh, wow. What's good? Okay. Where, where are you from, sir? I'm from uh, Los Angeles, but I live in Memphis, Tennessee, yep. from America. All right, okay. Thank you so much for joining. It's the first time in a while that I've been joined by a non-Filipino boxing fans. I was speaking in English, and I thought, yeah, there you go. That's why. Yes, sir, man. I just uh, happened to see your video, and, mm. man, I'm happy to be on the panel with you to talk about this great fight between Terrence Crawford and Sean Porter. I think that fight, man, was a it was an instant classic. It was a great toe-to-toe -to -toe action. Um, Sean Porter put on a great performance, and so did Terrence Crawford. It was it was a great fight. Uh, what about you? What did you think? Well, I, I I do agree with you that it was a great fight. Although you know, there's there's some um, uh, something in me that I, I thought that uh, the the stoppage uh, would have been the it was it was a little bit early for me. Um, I thought uh, it would have been better if they both ended the fight on their own terms, not uh, by the, the corner stopping it. But it was great. I mean, uh, uh, Porter showed that he can box. He was fast on his feet and his hands. He was uh, showing uh, different uh, moves to Crawford uh, until, of course, Crawford adjusted and was able to, to catch him with the, with, the, with the counter that put him down in the 10 round. But it was really good. I, I had a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah, so do, did I, man. It was uh, very competitive. It, it, it was a war in that fight, man. Uh, um, Sean Porter came out very fast. He tried to jump on uh, Terrence Crawford. Of course, Sean Porter has the experience in the big fights. He's been in the ring with some of the best, like your Dennis Ugas. Uh, Sean Porter fought against uh, Keith Thurman when Keith yes. Thurman was undefeated champion. Also, he'd been in there with Earl Spence, and nobody was able to stop him. Now, yeah. I heard you say that uh, the stoppage was uh, too soon, but, um, I mean, Sean Porter was hurt. He got dropped two times. The first time, Terrence Crawford dropped him with an uppercut. The second time, yes. he dropped him with a right hook. And uh, two knockdowns, his legs didn't seem like they was there. And uh, the trainer, his father, uh, Kenny Porter, Sean Porter's dad, he stopped the fight because – he knew his son was in danger. There you go. Yeah, yeah. You know, I was saying that as well, because uh, Kenny was the father and the trainer. He he looked at uh, Sean as the father, uh, the son, and, and the boxer, and he doesn't want to get his son hurt. But I was just thinking, if, if it was a, a different trainer, he would have given himself a chance because this is a big fight. And uh, now I know that it was his last fight, so it's hard to get out uh, on, in boxing. Um, retiring like that that uh, you know you surrendered but you know i, I get your point um of course the, a lot of people were criticizing that one for me I, i'm just trying to echo what the fans are saying but you know i totally agree i mean no one knows porter or sean better than his father and uh it was you know it was already a good payday so why why get hurt right <laughs> yes i think if the fight would have continued I think he would have got knocked out cold. And I think that's why his father uh, stopped the fight. Sean Porter is a warrior. Um, the fight was very close before the knockdowns and the stoppage. How, how did you have the fight scored before uh, the knockdowns? Before I was going to ask you that one. I was going to ask you that one. I, I saw the scorecard. It was all in favor of Crawford. Um, and uh, some of my friends, they were thinking they were, uh, that Porter was ahead by a, a point or two. But I actually agreed with the scorecard. I, I had it at least a, a point or two points for, for Crawford. What, what did you see? It was very close, man. It was so close. Uh, man, I don't even know how to score it. I think I could. it could have been tied. It could have been even at that point. Or, you know, Sean Porter was doing some good work in there, brother. It, the fight was – it was probably tied. I think it was tied at that point. What about you? Mm -hmm. Would you say probably tied? It was that no, close? no, no. I, I think Crawford was ahead for but, me. Okay, I respect that. For me, it, it was very close. It could have been, you know, even at that time. But see, like early in that fight, Sean Porter had the experience. Sean Porter, he's been in there with some of the top welterweights already, and this was Terrence Crawford, his first uh, like real test in the welterweight division. Yeah, and um, you know. 
Sean Porter was making it a rough and tough fight. Sean Porter is a warrior. He's a gladiator. And yes. uh, Sean, uh, Terrence Crawford showed the toughness as well. But um, uh, I feel like, uh, you know, Sean Porter was doing some good work in there, man. He he was roughing up Terrence Crawford. Uh, you you seen uh, Sean Porter. He had a cut over his eye, and so did Terrence Crawford. Yes. He had a cut over, I think, like his forehead right there. Um, did, did you feel like Sean Porter – Hurt Terrence Crawford any time in the fight? Did you that was what, what that is what I was um, trying to see. But every time, I mean, I, I've seen some solid blows from uh, Porter to Crawford, and every time he does that, the Crawford just smile, and I, I didn't really see him hurt. I, I'm sure he is hurt, but uh, he didn't show any signs that he was really uh, bothered with with the punches. Uh, so I I couldn't really say. Maybe he's not. Maybe he is. Um, one other thing that I would like to mention, and I'll have uh, people come in here. Uh, guys, you can speak Filipino or English, don't worry. Um, uh, but, you know, you were saying that Porter was a warrior. Indeed, he was. He was really aggressive. But that, that, was, that is his strength, right? Age money. That also became his kryptonite because he was attacking when he got tagged with a counter punch. And he did that twice because he, was, he wanted to go get back. And therefore, you know. Uh, that became his kryptonite. Him being aggressive, that's where he got countered and he got hurt. Yeah, I seen like early in the fight, Terrence Crawford was hesitating. I'm not sure why he was hesitating. Maybe it was because he respected Sean Porter's power and the mm -hmm. strength of a Sean Porter. But once Terrence Crawford, he you know he started heating up, he he got warmed up. Then he mm -hmm. started letting his hands go. Every time Crawford started letting his hands go, he was connecting with uh, with Sean Porter. And, uh, you know, he he hurt Sean Porter a couple of times, man. Uh, but it, it was such a great fight, brother. I, I like your yes. channel. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing some more of your videos. Me, myself, I have my own YouTube channel, H Money Boxing. Uh, you, you should come check me out whenever you get a chance. Uh, so sure usually on, on your channel, you drop the link like you did today or it's just for uh, just for this video. Are Usually at the end, so I do my solo first, and then at, at the end I get uh, to interact with fans. Uh, it's a usual thing that we do here in the Philippines where I get the comments of the fans. But yeah, brother, you're welcome to also join us uh, every now and then, every time you're available. Um, and uh, yeah, I'll check your channel, H Money Boxing. You might yes, want to check I it out. Three, yeah, three different channels. I have H Money Boxing, I have H Money Channel, and I have H Money Boxeo. Brother, uh, man, boxing wow. is a worldwide sport. You know, people love boxing all over the world, in the Philippines, in, in uh, Japan. People love boxing in Puerto Rico, uh, in uh, Cuba, Mexico, you know, the UK, everywhere, brother. And I appreciate your platform. I'm looking forward to, uh, you know, building a relationship with you. And, man, uh, thank you so much, my, my brother. And Terrence Crawford is pound for pound one of the best fighters in the world. He's a three-division champion, former undisputed champion. And now, you know, he, he just beat uh, Sean Porter. He's the first man to knock out Sean Porter. Yes. And he made a statement. I think Canelo is one of the best. Canelo and Terrence Crawford are my two best. And Alexander yeah. Usyk should be number three. So thank you so much, my brother. And I'll be back. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Thank you so much. You must have a lot of H money because you have a lot of channels. But thank you. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right. Thank you, brother. I see you around. Nice having you. Okay. All right. Napalaban tayo sa English, ha? Ala nyo, ha? All right. Powcast Sports. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell.